Well, hello everybody, Tyler here with Build Ready. I wanted to show you guys a certain type of sealant. Um, at the end of these projects, it's part of our uh, punch out list that we have to um, fire seal uh, the penetrations in the garage firewall. So in most projects across the country, uh, you'll have a garage and excuse the mess. This is uh, once again, uh, punch out stage. So everything's getting cleaned up here. But you'll see that this is the common wall uh, from the home into uh, the garage. And that's a fire rated door. And basically there, uh, there's code that requires us to have a fire separation from the garage to the home. So in the event that a fire or something were to break out in the, in the garage, it does not easily travel into the home. And there's different methods for this fire, uh, this fire uh, assembly. Um, and it differs uh, from area to area that I've found. But one thing that is the same pretty much across the country is the use of a fire sealant similar to this. So if you look at this, um, we have a, you know, some of these penetrations that come through this firewall. And what they want us to do is they want us to use this sealant, uh, which is like a red sealant, and they make various other colors. Uh, they all have different ratings, which, uh, are listed out right here. And if you read the tubes, they all have different uh, time frame ratings or uses. Um, but this is the sealant that we use. It stays uh, the most pliable and it is accepted by our area as a fire sealant. So you'll see even in the fire assembly up on the roof here, uh, around the garage door opener, uh, we have uh, used this fire sealant uh, to caulk around that. Uh, and that prevents uh, any fire from breaking out and burning through the sealant and up into an, and in, up into the attic area or the firewall and being that uh, fire barrier. So anyways, if you're building a home, you need to make sure at punch out, you'll more than likely get called on it if you don't. Uh, so it's a good idea to plan on purchasing some of this and doing this as part of your final punch out phase.